Bam! Before we get the video started, I just want to say we're doing a giveaway on ghostworkshop.com. Every $5 you spend is an entry. So if you spend $10, that's two entries. We're going to be giving away an F450 RC. These things are actually pretty sweet. It's a RTR ready to run. All you have to have is a battery. It's got the cool little American forces. But we are going to be giving away the uh, giveaways from October 1st to December 1st. So just in time for Christmas. So make sure to head over to Ghost Workshop, pick you up some ghost merch, get you... I, ha I absolutely love the camouflage hat, so head on over there, and uh, you can win one. Not this one, though. This is mine, and I'm, I'm not giving it away. Color may vary. What is going on, guys? Ghost here, and today we are back on the farm now. We're not going to be joining my brother, unfortunately, but hopefully he'll be back on the farm a couple more times. It seems like anytime he's on, we're always doing crops and stuff. All right, so we got a couple things we got to talk about. First thing, really hot out here. Feels good this morning. First thing is, um, we did oil, oil radish seed or something, and a lot of comments said basically all it did was kind of like fertilize the ground for the like next crop we kind of plant and stuff. So, we kind of screwed the pooch on that one. Now, we haven't made it over here yet. We just over here and this big old cedar did wonderful. But, <laughs> we got to make money. It's the name of the game. So, we kind of messed up on this. Like I said, we are not farmers. Don't claim to be farmers. And, uh, like, basically, we get all of our information from the comments. So, you all help whenever y'all, you know, give good comments and everything. Well, all comments. Well, some of them's good. Some, you know. But anyways, uh, give comments about, you know, tips and tricks of doing different things, especially when it comes to farming. We do appreciate that. All right, second thing is, I've got these two trucks that literally need to be built. This one just rims the tires, paint job, good to go. This one, we have to put a new bed and everything, and guess what? It's sitting at my future shop. This is where the shop's going to be. But we got to get these trucks done because I am getting project trucks built up and we got to make some money. Now the hundred and some thousand dollars for the SEMA truck is still waiting to clear so we don't have that much money. But I do have a quick job that we are going to be doing. Um, my buddy down at the car lot um, said that uh, apparently this girl has I think it's F-250 or 350 single cab long wheelbase and uh, is something burning over there? Oh, it's the smokestack. I'm like, something is burning. <laughs> I thought it was my tractor run, to be honest. But uh, basically, just wants a little, like, SEMA truck treatment. We're going to do rims, painted. Uh, we're going to do, like, custom painted headlights, um, traction bars, and, you know, like, basically color matching. Kind of, It's going to be, like, kind of almost the blue of my truck. Kind of like a turquoise. And pink headlights, which I think will look pretty good because, you know, crazy combinations like really go good like that. But we're going to go pick that truck up. Um, shouldn't take too long to do, so we're going to have to, let's go ahead and start the Cummins up. I should have knew to, like, let that thing start. It, it has that auto start. We just press the button and it does the same thing. All right, and I got to get my trailer. And also, another thing, we got to, we got to really get this driveway like paved or something because right now it's just it's it's awful I'm trying to bring customers vehicles up here and literally I have to wash them before we leave and then when we get to the end of the driveway it's already bad so going to get my brother on that but hey we got to fix this all right let me go ahead and put his truck up I just want to let y'all know He's been keeping that squad of trucks. So, oh, oh, dirt slinger. I, I think he's a squad of truck person. Hey, each of their own. All right, we got to get rid of this rack on here. Um, where can, I think I'm just going to put it over here. We'll just unload it here. But I do want to start, hopefully, in the next couple of days or something, working on uh, getting the garage started cut some trees down i talked to uh, my brother i was like hey can i put it there he's like yeah it's fine and everything i told him i would build him a garage y'all wait till what we're, we're gonna build him a little workshop so he has his own too 
All right, let me go ahead and put the tailgate up. Got to have the tailgate up. I got it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. For Mr. Griffin, got to put the tailgate up. <laughs> oh, see, like, I'll always remember that. All right, so we're going to head on to the shop over here, pick up. That's what sucks. It's like we're literally taking it from a garage and putting it on a farm to work on. But we're going to pick it up. Uh, it should have a lot of the parts in the truck already, like the headlights and stuff. And the rims should be coming in very soon. So it should be a, a fairly quick turnaround build. Like I said, you know, just headlights and all that stuff. It's a lot of bolt-on. Now the color matching and stuff, that won't be the problem. Dang, look at that. Looks like... Look, oh, oh, slow down. About to run over to the Griswolds. Looks like he got a camper down there or something. What? Not uh, an RV, not a camper. Good grief. All right, it's pulling this bad boy. That camper actually looks pretty nice. RV. Oh, my gosh. Like, uh, RV, not camper. RV. That RV looks really nice. All right, I'm guessing that's the truck. I probably could have just brought my truck down here and got it, but... I like to at least have it, you know. I'm gonna let it run. Look at this bad boy. That thing is nice. A Tiffin? Man, this is one of those, you know, like, you know, my fancy motorhomes and stuff, and you're like, dang, look at that! And then, like, you look around this motorhome, you're like, dude, that thing is sick inside. Then you look around your house, and you're like, I'm broke. Happens to me every time. All right, let's go in here, talk to him, get the keys and stuff, and make it happen, Captain. All right, so, got the keys and everything, uh, talk to him, and um, I got a list of everything we need to do. Also, got some good news. My tailgate goes down. Um, that actually, this RV is actually, he's wanting to sell it. Not bad. I mean, it, the motor's blown in it. And it's like, what's up with this guy buying stuff blow motors but apparently he buys some stuff that's in bad shape and fixes it just for kind of a hobby all right yeah let's go ahead and load this up the thing don't sound that bad but yeah i guess the girl like it it, it was kind of a farm truck and now kind of want like kind of like a sema style to it so we got to remove the toolbox and the rack and everything's gonna be color matched we're getting rid of the chrome i think the only chrome we're gonna have is like the logo there this is a what is this a F three fifty? All right, so it's a pretty good sized truck. All right, let's go ahead and put this bad boy up on there, and we are rocking and rolling. Going to be a quick little turnaround. I guess we'll back down the road. I wish this driveway was a little bit bigger. It needs to be a little bit bigger. Oh, slow down. Make a turn. Well, we know which that road right there, or no, the one behind him. I don't know. Like, when were that road kept? I wish we had like a straight shot to this guy's shop and make life a little bit more easier. But I guess we're gonna head on down the road. Make sure nothing's coming. I love how we have to like cross the median here. One day we'll, they'll have like gravel passes for us. All right. Well, yeah, we're good, ma'am. You're just gonna have to wait. Thank you. I think you're actually in the other lane too, aren't you? Yeah, you are. All right, back to the farm we go. I hear the tires roaring. That's <laughs> awesome. All right, we just chugging along up the old driveway here. Um, I guess, guess we can go. Ahead. I'm just gonna go ahead and take it out to the other garage. I love this little bump I put here. I need, <laughs> I need to fix that. Oh, making a turn. He's making a left turn. That go. Had a little, little transmission issue back there. We didn't make. <laughs> All right, let me go ahead and get this bad boy off of here. I actually really do like this truck. She may or may not move. Oh, by the way, we're putting another grill on. Unfortunately, the grill is not. Uh, it, it's kind of it's already been powder coated so I'll, I'll end up having to remove the powder coating eventually but not right now i'll just tell customer if they want it pink then we can do a pink later on but we are going to get rid of all this chrome because remember chrome don't get you home this truck's actually really extremely nice 
It's actually almost, well, or a diff is like, it's almost as big as my truck. Or, uh, at least, uh, long as it. But, it does have a long bed. Alright, so we gotta take the toolbox and everything out of it, get it painted. It's gonna be a little process, but we'll get it. We'll definitely get it. I guess I'm just gonna back it over here. I definitely get me a paint booth one day. <laughs> actually have a garage that looks like hey you know what these guys might actually know what they're doing because right now if i rolled up and seen my outfit yeah it wouldn't be working all right um i want to go in change real fast and uh work clothes on we, sh we should have a lot of the parts in there and the tires and stuff i asked they should be in today sometime because he had my address and he said he had them just uh basically kind of forward to the house all right so just went ahead and uh, got the traction bars all done and everything. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Now, the color is a little off than my truck. This is kind of more of a, tur a turquoise. And literally just driving it around in the driveway, backing it up and stuff here. It literally is already dirty. It's, oh, I hate this driveway. But anyways, um, move that barrel over. Um... We checked everything. We got the traction bars and wanted traction bars. She wanted, uh, we got the American Force rims, tires on it, got rid of the, the rack and everything. Everything's kind of color matched. Said we was going to leave this though. Um, we even have the little bullet antenna with the little color match tip, you know. Um, if you need a bullet, just grab that, stick it in, good to go. Um, these are the custom headlights and everything. As you see, the grill already came, um, powder coat i thought it was going to be uh like a raw style grill and we could paint it but we'll have to paint it or probably try to powder coat it because i feel like that'd be better i uh, powder coat it i don't know either the turquoise or the pink i think the pink will look good in my opinion but it's up to the customer but i didn't want to do that yet because i figured they might have ordered it like that so definitely asking stuff but this thing is absolutely nice we do have a a, a tune and everything on it so she will get down and go. I guess she will. I haven't like, like tried it out yet. Go ahead and pull on out. Take it to the driveway. Air driveway is like the the test area. We got a big enough field. We need to build a on drag strip. We got a go kart track back there that we barely use. Definitely want to have to do that. Here, let me pull up here. I don't want to jump this. Well, your suspension works. I jumped it. <laughs> All right, let's do it in three, three, two, one, go. I wish you could like boost launch it. All right, we're to the floor. She, uh, she gets there. All right, we did about 50. Not really that fast to be tuned, to be honest. Um, and a single cab. So, I uh, definitely have to tell them all that. They might need to check that out and everything but the truck looks fantastic believe it or not it's like it's really nice and it's like the, these uh these crazy colors are definitely coming back i like anything with crazy colors i mean to be honest i wouldn't mind my cummins over there having you know different color rims or something on because chrome's okay but they do chip and everything but i actually well anything chips but i actually really like this truck so I'm going to call and I'm guessing they might come pick it up or we go drop it off. My thing is, will this thing flex? Can we flex deferred? I actually really like this truck. Oh, we're not, <laughs> not flexing too good. Old traction bars is holding in there. All right. I like it. Everything looks good. Um... I guess I'm going to call the owner and tell her her truck is done and where she wants us to take it to. Man, that thing is nice. We're really stepping our game up, but y'all haven't seen nothing like this is nice. But wait, and the Cummins down there probably, it's the single cab. It's going to be nice, but wait until you see the cat. I like, oh man, that thing's going to be ridiculously nice. I'm going to have to get rid of it because I've been looking at some, uh, uh, some different pictures and stuff. Actually, let's go ahead and watch this truck. Different pictures and stuff on how I really want to do it. It's going to be nice. I think we're going to paint it a nice blue. I know what's up with the blue, but it ain't going to be. It's going to be like a satin blue. I think it's going to be real pretty. All right, let me go ahead and get the 
this out. Swash this. Do do do. Since we just got it painted and stuff, kind of have to watch. Look at that thing. It's so nice. I actually like this. And like the rims are so bright. I feel like feel like they would actually like glow at night time. Actually, that would be kind of cool. Look at that bad boy. Ooh yeah. All right. Let's go ahead. I want to back. I guess we'll back it over to the house. Call her and uh, get it going. That's a uh, twenty-five hundred dollars in your pocket. Plus, I mean, I know it ain't a lot to do all this stuff with, but they provided like everything. And we're trying to keep our prices low right now because we're literally doing it in a barn beside our harvester. So it's like I don't know how. Like we're we're professional. It's like none of our vehicles have fell apart yet. Make sure I like curve the rims. I'm sorry, ma'am. I curved your rims on my flower bed. <laughs> All right, we'll park right here. This is like our showcase, even though nobody drives up the driveway. <sighs> Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you hit the like button. It always helps the video if you hit the like button. It just, you know, it, it, it really does help. Uh, make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you punch that subscribe button. And also, this is Ghost, and I hope everyone is having a blessed day. Oh, man, look at that thing. Woo! Went from, I guess it really wasn't a farm truck. If it's a farm truck, it's a nice farm truck. To a cruising, going to the mall truck. I don't know. Reminds me of a bubble gum machine. <laughs>